So when you see this chart, if you realize what will be the first manifestation in iron toxicity, since it's going to the intestine, it will first be a gastric manifestation. Later on, as uh, the hours pass by and the iron toxicity increases, they can present later on with shock. They can present with cardiac function, uh, uh, dysfunction and liver toxic, uh, uh, liver manifestations. And then it can, uh, develop, uh, they can develop further multi-organ failure. Uh, and severe metabolic acidosis. So now, now let's see the stages of iron toxicity. We have seen how the iron acts when it's in a toxic level. Now let's see how what will be the stages. So initially, at zero to six hours, where is the iron in the intestine? So it will be causing direct corrosive effect on the GI tract. So it can present as vomiting, diarrhea, abdominal pain. When there's severe ulceration and loss of blood, they can also have hypovolemic shock. After 6 to 12 hours, which is usually said to be the latent phase, so why is it latent? It has gone out from the intestine. So it is getting distributed in the other cells of the body, other organs of the body. So this phase is usually said to be quincent and uh, you might feel that the ch person has recovered. But usually we have to be very careful even during this phase because the next phase after 12 to 48 hours will present, they can present with shock and metabolic acidosis. 